A recent public appearance by Meghan Markle and Prince Harry in Kingston, Jamaica, has ignited a controversy surrounding Meghan's use of a $33,000 earned freebie from designer Jennifer Meyer. The issue came to light in a common thread discussing Meghan's Jamaican outfit, with a source highlighting a jewelry scandal involving Jennifer Meyer, Meghan, and Prince Harry. During Meghan's 72 days as a working royal, she sported several pieces of jewelry from designer Jennifer Meyer, who is known for her Hollywood connections as the daughter of the co-founder of talent agency CAA. Brands' approach to dress senior British royals are required to sign non-disclosure agreements NDAs, and are prohibited from using the Royal Association for marketing purposes. When Meghan wore Jennifer Meyer's jewelry, the designer posted a link to purchase the pieces on Instagram, violating the NDA. Kensington Palace promptly ordered the removal of the product link, emphasizing the seriousness of Meyer breaking the non-disclosure agreement. There are speculations about the possibility that Meyer may have paid Meghan to wear the jewelry as an influencer or walking billboard. Alternatively, it is suggested that Meyer may have provided the jewelry for free in exchange for positive press and advertisements disguised as good press. Senior royals are generally not allowed to receive free goods to avoid conflicts of interest. However, Meghan's acceptance of company gifts while working for the royal family, as mentioned in Prince Harry's memoir, suggests that receiving free jewelry as a working royal wasn't unprecedented. The latest earrings worn by Meghan in Jamaica cost $3,250, and the combined cost of all jewelry worn by her from Jennifer Meyer exceeds $155,000. Meghan did sign a merchandising agreement with Meyer, but when questioned by Buckingham Palace about Instagram photos, Meghan reportedly threw Meyer under the bus, claiming that Meyer posted the photos on her own initiative. In response, the royal family's lawyers sent a strongly worded cease and desist letter to Meyer. This incident, part of Meghan's broader wardrobe dealings, resulted in the decision to ban freebies for Meghan by the royal family serving as a reminder of her awareness of merchandising. This revenge hit Meghan particularly hard in Hollywood, impacting her social standing. An article in The Sun sheds light on the workings of Meghan's wardrobe, revealing that the founders of a jewelry company, Jessica Dovey and Sydney Nahaus, secured Meghan to wear their earrings through cold emails and direct appeals to her. The broader context includes a questionable clothing expenditure by Meghan while King Charles was footing the bill, spending over a million on clothes before King Charles intervened and put a stop to it. The surprising aspect is not only the use of Meghan to sell products publicly, but also the curiosity about why anyone would buy anything worn by Meghan, given the perception of her taste as non-existent.